resolution urging Pat McPherson to resign. It all stems from a racist blog on a website that McPherson runs. KMTV Action 3 News reporter Josh Egbert has the story. The State Board of Education says this storm of attention and outrage is likely to continue, therefore hindering their work. But Pat McPherson says he's staying put. I move to make the motion for the resignation of Mr. Patrick McPherson. In a 6-2 to two vote, the Nebraska State Board of Education called for Pat McPherson to resign. How effective can he be when the governor of the state has directed him to uh, resign? Before the vote, McPherson spoke out, telling the board he failed in policing the conservative blog, but did not write the racial remarks. Posts made by me and reflecting my opinions were signed by me. I've disavowed the offensive posts made by others and have closed down the blog. More than a dozen people showed up to support McPherson. They say this frenzy is politically motivated. I think this was a, a hatchet job on him. I think that they, uh, the left wing wants to get him off the board because he is a conservative. It's very simple. But those that want him off the board say it's not a partisan attack. It's all about right and wrong. This is a blog that Mr. McPherson founded, co-edited, regularly contributed to, and often publicly promoted. Despite today's vote, McPherson says he won't resign and wants to turn the focus back to education. For those who say my presence, one vote among, among those seven other well-intentioned people on this board will impede the board the job is doing, I say that that notion is false. The Nebraska legislature is also expected to draft similar legislation asking for McPherson's resignation. Reporting from Lincoln, Josh Egbert, KMTV Action 3 News.